There are so many attractions in St. Louis, and one you may not know about is a few miles down Interstate 44. In his Milu feature, Runny Knot shows us how a man's dream of creating a tiny railroad is now a big community. It's a vision. It's seven years worth of work right here. A long time dream. You have to have that dream. You have to have that vision. Rolling at the Iron Spike Model Train Museum. No other museum like us in the Midwest. Representing. It's not some place. It's what it represents. A realistic glimpse into how the railroads help build our country. We show people what trains are and how they operate. The small trains are quite a sight to behold. The little ones are the best, though. When they get back here, their little heads almost explode. People have come from far and wide to see the setups. We've had visitors from 25 different countries. The train cars moving through towns. Oh, there's a coffee shop, there's a bike shop. And chugging by countryside. No scene is built without real life in mind. No details are left out of the scenery. This is three-dimensional art. There are stories being told by the train tracks little stories that you can see in miniature. Don and his wife tell the stories of the life along the rails with help from the community. They all saw my passion. Volunteers keep things running. There is a lot of maintenance. Donations keep the iron spike expanding. So many things have come to us by the grace of God. Now, there is 10,000 square feet of trains right in this room alone. He can't believe how it's grown. Never, ever in my whole life figured that my dream would develop into something like this. But he doesn't see this as just a hobby. This 501c3 charity has become his way of giving back. I wanted to give something back uh, all my life. And a way of keeping this genre. This is history. This is real history. Rolling into the future. Growing the next generation of model train enthusiasts. That was Rennie Knott reporting. The Iron Spike is open Wednesdays through Sundays. It's on High Street in Washington, Missouri. Up next.